Okay, Blade is the first guy I want to recruit. You need a ton of respect to recruit him, though. So I'm gonna go farm respect a bit. Also, I need to get my stats up, because Blade's tough. Frat boys, weak enemies, easy money. I like how the frat boys wear pink. And as you can obviously tell, this is a Japanese game, as you can see from the Japanese schoolboy uniforms. Except if I don't know what uh, school has pink uniforms. Anyways, if, if you didn't read at the beginning, the whole plot of this game essentially is Ryan's girlfriend is being kidnapped. I'm using Ryan here. And you have to go uh, save her. How would that hurt? Oh, Jesus. It takes forever to get up now. I should just run back to town. Yeah, I cannot take the eagles right now. Running start, giant leap. Okay. Pharmacy. Antidote 12. Lion's milk healed me a lot last time. Did I just say milk? Milk. When I was a kid, I used to say milk. I don't know why. Lion first. Defense, willpower, lots of health. Good. Antidote, willpower, maximum health. Is there a bookstore here? Good. Malik has the one English sign. Nuclear spy, that sounds awesome. And I can afford a... I guess another nuclear spy, because I'm pretty sure that gives me attack. I should check my stats after I use these. I suck at humming. Okay, so defense and toughness, that's good. Defense is like your ability to block attacks. Toughness is uh, like your your armor, I guess it would be like. You take less damage from hits. A lot of willpower off books, too. Okay, my punch and kick are the same, pretty low. I think every stat max is out at 255, but having 255 of anything is complete overkill. You do not need that much. I like the little hollow heart next to people's names. Okay, I've got all right defense and toughness, but I'm still not as strong as bosses. I'm just better at the game than bosses. Willpower is good. And I got about half my health right now. Now that park where I saw my friend Rick. Oh, mob, they're tough. I should get some money off that. They probably give me good respect. I accidentally hit that one when he's down. What was that magazine? I think it was a magazine I read that gave me one attack and one kick. I could use some of those. I mean, one isn't very much. I think there's one that's like 25 bucks and it's like American anime or something. I, I remember that one being really good. It's like punch and weapon skill, I think. Man, I'm doing some like Ronma one half fighting up here, like standing on this ledge. Uh, if anyone hasn't seen that show, watch that show. It's really old. I'm sure you can find it on YouTube or something, or buy a DVD set like I did. And make sure you get like I I don't there's probably some kind of censored version stuff. Don't get the censored version, because it really takes a lot out of it. But they do have really good English dubs that are uncensored. I mean, um around season four, I think. You know the guy who did um any of you out there who are anime fans, uh, I'm not a big fan of Inuyasha, but the voice actor who did Inuyasha's voice in the English version, uh, he also did Ranma's voice after, like, season four. And uh, it fits pretty well. Anyways, yes, uh, Ranma One Half is a really old anime. I don't know what year, but I would guess late 80s, early 90s. It's really good, though. Okay, I don't want to throw them in the pit, because it would be an easy kill, but I wouldn't get the money, because they dropped the money. I hope the microphone isn't picking up Murray scratching on my door wanting in. I love my flying dragon kick. Oh, speaking of dragons. Oh, assholes. I <laughs> did like a... Uppercut, they're flying through the sky. They're killing themselves. I better not be losing respect when they hit themselves. I'm out of here. Okay, that's the park I go to if I want to fight Blade. I don't want to fight him. Jesus, I can jump. 
I need food. Tuna roll. Willpower. Stamina. No, I want something with stats. Okay, I guess I'm gonna be fighting a little bit here. I'm debating off-screening this, because it might be kind of boring. Are they just throwing at each other now? I guess I'll just on-screen it, because otherwise it's gonna be a really short Let's Play. Because, like, this game is only about half an hour long if you already have the stats to beat it. <laughs> Okay, maybe 45 minutes. The final boss battle can be a bitch, though. Although there is kind of a glitch you can exploit to easily send the guy flying off a ledge because you're fighting on top of a school. But I don't want to use that glitch. I want to fight him fair and square. Um, what's a... I need money. I need a gang member. That's what I need. So I can get money fast. Okay, I'll run into the wall and stay down. Huddle around me. I need to fight a more aggressive gang than these guys. Get over here. Get back here, Chez. Damn it. Make me miss out on money. I'm one screen from the start of the game right now. I should go farther and fight tougher gangs. I like how I'm like a one-man wrecking crew, just destroying entire gangs of people. No! Money! These only go guys only drop like a buck twenty. I shouldn't really throw them directly up. Okay. Generic dudes. Okay, if I get knocked down here, will they gang around me? I don't think there's anything to run into. Can I run into this? There. Hit me. Hit me. Hit me. Thank you. Hit me again. <sighs> Assholes. Gave you that much time. You got sticks, you got chains, and you don't even hit me. I need to get my punch skill up. Oh, did he... <laughs> the way the one guy came on screen, the other one went off. It almost looked like he ran around the world. Blade's right in that park there, but I don't want to fight him yet. Because you have a boss battle with him, and if you don't have enough respect with him, then uh, he doesn't join you, so I gotta get him to join. He's the hardest one to get you to join, I find. He's the one who requires the least respect, but it never seems like he wants to join, and you only get one shot at it. No! Oh, waste of money. Yes, you are wasted. I like how I have nothing to say by this point. You know what I have a craving for? Peanut butter. Don't know why. Really fat thing to say, actually. <laughs> enough for that? No, I think I need 25 bucks for it. It's not even here right now. You'll know some of those books are ridiculously expensive, like upwards to $300. Those give you abilities, like my my mock punch I start with. Uh, personally, I don't think any of them are worth saving up for. Because for that, if I had that amount of money, I'd just get my stats up a bunch, make my dragon mock 
punch of the flying tiger thing really strong. Die, Pete. I like the generic names, I love it. Roy. Okay, I gotta have enough money now. I really like running and jumping in this game, it's fun. Here comes the fun part, entering and exiting the store till they have one. American anime, here we go. And they didn't have enough, they almost didn't have enough letters, so they had to take out the space. This is so cool. Punch increased by three. Weapon increased by three, jump increased by four, willpower. See, that was good. Now I want a little bit more money to heal up a little more, to get my willpower full, then I'll go fight Blade. Ow. Now, Blade's specialty, every every boss kind of has their own specialty thing. Blade's specialty is if you give him chains. He's really good with weapons, and he has an ability where he can throw a chain, and it wraps around people, so uh, they can't attack temporarily. So they're an easy target. It's really good to uh, kind of farm around till you find the eagles, and then always bring a long chain with you, because him with the long chain is lethal. The best one of the zombie gang, which I'm trying to recruit though, there are four of them. They're just called the zombies, they're part of like the plague team or whatever they're called. They dress in red. Um, the best one though isn't even the boss of them, it's Flying Turk. He's got an ability where he teleports and kicks the guy in the groin. It's awesome. It's kind of magical though, which is weird because this is a very not magic game. <laughs> I think this just kind of implied he runs really fast. So have whatever this is. This is no, wait, I don't have the money for that. This. I'll eat eel. Stamina increased by a lot. That's great. Now I'm out of money. I need to go buy, like, a cheap book to get my willpower up. Mob's turf. This will give me money. Also make me lose my health. See, the good thing about the farming money like this, though, is I get respect for every uh, gang I beat up. Ah, tires. Ah, people. I like how they're fully willing to throw each other. Jesus, those tires hurt. Oh my god. Yeah, they're killing my willpower. At least they're hitting me while I'm down a lot, giving me respect. I don't get how people not showing me respect gives me respect. Oh, I might have to retreat. I'm getting dropped on the ground long enough that they have time to pick me up and throw me. Oh! Come on, I can hardly get up. And they're annoying, they try and stay out of range. Oh, I hit two guys while they're down that time. That lost me some points. Some running attacks. Oh, Jesus. Massacre there. I don't know if I can win this. There's the last guy. Good. So that, at least I know that the gang's almost beaten up. And one just ran away. Oh no, he's getting a weapon. Get up. Oh, little stutter in the recording there. One on one now. Me and you, buddy. Let's go. Oh, he does have a lot of damage. He's dropping at four health. Get up. Jesus, come on, get up. That was awesome. Drill him in the back of the head. That got me some cash. Got like 11 bucks off that whole gang. And I think a few of them ran. Okay, I need willpower desperately. Pretty sure this is the cheapest book. Let's get a fashion magazine too, because I think that gives toughness. I'm gonna need that. I don't have money. No, no, no. Okay, this gives five toughness and doesn't give me any willpower. The entrees, yes! Money, money, money. 
They have a good amount of health. They, uh... So it's gonna be hard to kill them. Gotta focus them down. They bring really rare and powerful weapons, and they run very often. They also drop the most money of any gang. They drop, I think it's like, five, six dollars per person. That's like a whole gang per person. Okay, that was all of them. Just made twenty-three dollars easily. Okay, I want, I want another two of these, because I'm gonna really need the toughness. A nuclear spy is good. Health isn't nearly as important as willpower. Scandal rank, okay. Squid. Oh man, I had Calamar before, so good. Squid, jump increased my own stamina by 12, so hardly healed and gave me a useless stat. Okay, get my toughing, my toughness up, my toughing, I'm fucking stupid. Um, nuclear sp spy, spy, oh my god, I'm illiterate. Okay, willpower is alright, toughness is really running strong. I'm sorry this is gonna be such a boring episode. Okay, what I really need right now, I'm good for toughness. I need punch skill. And I need willpower. What gives me punch? I know there's an online guide, but I don't want to check it. There's like a shop guide that tells you what the items give you. I don't want to check it. It seems like cheating to me. Gotta experiment with all the items, you know? Okay, uh, hey, get back here. Is that all of them? Yep, okay. Gotta take this pipe with me. Into the bookstore. Kill some people. Uh, I don't have enough for a scandal rig. Uh, is there a pharmacy here? No. This is a bakery. Hot cocoa. Oh, wait, this is a cafe. Okay, I'll down it. I don't know why it was green. Defense increased by 1, willpower by 10, stamina by 10. That sucked. There's so many crappy items, I gotta figure out what the good ones are. Okay, I'll get some more willpower with them right. Eat the entrees, yes. The javelin. Get up! Oh yes, you get like 7 bucks off these guys, I love it. Any more? No? Okay. 21 bucks. Nice. Wish they would spawn more often. Mystic Seer. Okay, I'll get a bunch of this. Because I'm pretty sure this is just a bunch of willpower. And for the last one, I might as well get some toughness. Never have too much. That's one of the best stats. I like how I just walk in there with a with like a high school gym javelin. Willpower, 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 toughness. So I got 47 toughness and almost maxed out willpower. 218. I'm ready to go fight Blade. Generic dudes, yeah. I might as well beat them for some last minute respect. I want my javelin. Okay, now the trick to beating a uh, blade, if you're not already way overpowered, is um, just keep him away from his chain at all times. So try and hold on to his chain, actually. If you're a weapon skill guy, you can use his chain against him. If not, just hit him often with weak attacks, just to get him to drop the chain. Because if he disables you with the chain, he'll just get free shots on you. I love the range of this thing. Okay, I'll let you finish your talking. Yeah, and I'm a zombie. Blah, blah, blah. You can't go nowhere till you beat me. Oh, see, that's what he does. When he does the little spin around thing before throwing it. 